Hi guys, this is Saurav. In this video, we will learn how we can create Fizz Spot app in MIT App Inventor. So here we can see the example of our app here. You will see here that's the pot here and that's the Fizz here. See? Okay. So we will create this game here. So let's create. So we need to click on Start New Project and then that's our app name, Fizz Spot. Click on OK. So that's the screen here. Now we need to drag and drop one canvas here. In the left side, you will see here drawing and animation. Okay, we need to drag and drop this canvas here and make this one with this fill parent and make this height should be fill parent like this. Now we need to change the background of this canvas. Okay, before it, we are going to drag and drop one image split also here, just this one like this. Now we have to make your background of a canvas. So click on canvas and just click on the background image and click on upload file. Click on choose file. I already have this background image. Okay. Transparent wall fish. Okay. So if you want to find, if you want to find this uh, uh, part, so you just need to just type here fish spot PNG image like this. Okay. And you will get there a lot of images here. You just need to drag and drop them and just use it. Okay, you will see that one image. Just download this image and use it uh, as a background here. Right. So I'm going to use it as a background. This image. Click on upload file. Click on choose file, and just select this file, and click on OK. Okay. Now we need to uh, use here one more image of this. Okay. You can use multiple face images here. Okay. So how to download this face image? So just type your face png okay and download these images like this you can download clay part images it look pretty good see like this one go to the mit app inventor click on image split and you will see here picture option click on the upload file click on choose file and you will find here that's the image i have okay and click on okay and wait some second and we have to make this width and height should be something Click on height and make this height 50 pixel and make this width should be 50, 50 pixel like this. Okay, it's look fine right now. Now we have to done some code. Okay, so we need to so uh, one thing we have to do that is we have to drag and drop one sensor here and that one is clock. Just click on sensor and we will find your clock. Just drag and drop this clock and make this time interval should be 100 not 1000 okay make it 1200 make it 100 right now go to the block section now here we need to do some code so first whenever uh, someone open this app it means whenever a screen in his slides then we have to make click on image split and you will find here set image split dot speed which one this one okay make set image speed one dot speed should be 10 this one make it here like this okay now we need to click on clock and whenever this one clock will fire so we have to check the condition if so click on just type here if okay and just use here if then else condition okay uh, no, we need to f uh, use here if only condition. So just type if and just enter. Drag and drop this if here and we are going to use here maths function. Click on maths and you will find here this one, third one. If click on make this one is greater. Now click on image spread one and you will find here image spread dot x. Drag and drop this if image spread dot x value is less than less than 40 okay so make this copy this value here like this and change this value to 40 okay go to the design section and i'll show you click on this image split and you will find here now x value is 131 if i just make this uh, image split is here you will find here this uh, image x value is 27 right so if the image this one uh, first reached uh, this uh, location so we have to make it back and then again like this 
okay we have to move this uh, fish like this right so that's why we uh, we have to done this code okay so when image split dot less than x value is less than 40 so we have to run this image in the in the uh, plus direction okay it means image split dot is speed to 100 uh, in speed to 10 but if we should use it as if like this just drag and drop this and use your condition again a copy paste and make image split dot x is greater than 250 okay if the value is greater than 250 so we we need to make this one image split should be minus 10 value should be minus 10 like this fine that's it so let's refresh this app and let's see how it's work see yeah that's it let's look amazing right so if you have any doubt you can ask me on comment and please subscribe my channel like this video and share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye <music>